Hey, what's up everybody? We're back in Tinkercad for the daily build. Uh, if you're brand new to Tinkercad, go back and watch part one and part two and part three. Get used to these shapes and uh, how the whole thing works. And you can follow along and build stuff with us. We do a video every day. So let's see, today we're still doing Halloween stuff uh, uh, for now. Uh, today we're going to try to do like a bat. I want to do like a bat that would like hang from the ceiling. So I want to make the wings really thin. So they'll kind of almost like curve down or like if you blew a fan on them, they would kind of, I don't know, not really flap around, but you get what I'm saying. Maybe they'll kind of hang a little bit like downward if it's hanging from its body, you know. So let's just try to make... Um, a really thin wing and then we'll print them flat out like this and maybe when we take it off the, the wings will kind of curve down when they're hanging you know so let's just make one wing and then we'll duplicate it and then we have to make a body so I don't know how hard this is gonna be but we're just gonna go for it uh, let's do a super thin point Four, I mean, that's pretty thin. I don't really know. We might even make it thinner than that. Um, so I am looking at a picture of a, a rubber bat that I that was in a thrift store that I was at. So I'm just kind of looking at it to see how the, the wing looks. Um, I guess I'm just going to start doing stuff. So see, we have to have the, the arm come out. And then there's basically like the little finger bones or little fingers that kind of add structure to the wing. I guess that would be the mammal's fingers because that's a it's a bat is a mammal. Um, okay, I better just start doing something or we'll never get done. I think we could use these little tubes for like his his arm and fingers. Uh, I won't see why. We would have a problem with that so let's let's just kind of stretch let's pretend his body is you know what why don't we make a little makeshift blobby body quick just so we can kind of visualize it okay let's just do this and drop it down a little bit like honestly like you know We'll probably have like a body, you know, kind of like this. There. There we go. There's uh there's our makeshift body for now. Okay, so let's let's see. Oh, the arm comes out. See, we could put it like this. Let me kind of check it out here. Uh this number, if you change this number, it'll make the tube smaller like like this direction okay so let me just see what would happen no we don't want that we don't want that and uh, this part's going to be kind of big i guess what if we tilted it kind of got rid of some of that maybe okay Yep, this might work. Let me see. Okay, now stretch it. Am I doing good? Yes, of course I'm doing good. Um Okay. Let's just let's just try that. I mean we gotta start somewhere. So look, here's his arm coming out. And I have a feeling we could use more of these. So let's just grab another one of these. And honestly, we don't have to snip any of this off quite yet. We're going to snip all this extra off, of course. Um, so let's make this even smaller. What happens if we... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay. Don't panic. We got this. Okay, let's spin this. And connect this up. Okay. Yeah, I mean... Okay, now we might have to snip this first. I think that's fine, right?
uh, yes. Okay, let's make this 0.7. Okay, and... Okay, should we snip this off? I think this one we might have to snip off before we start placing it. So let's kind of cut this. See, it's best if you don't know what you're doing. Because you just do stuff until it looks good. We've had it work in the past, so we will stick with that strategy. Okay, so we like this. This is this is cool. Yeah, see, this is easy. Okay, and see, we're gonna snip off. You know, we're gonna be cutting stuff up here, so we can leave that. Um, okay, so let's. Can I still make this narrower? Oh, not so much now that I snipped it. Oops. What am I doing? I guess I can like this. Oh, there we go. So see, I. Sh I squish that down. Um, for some reason, the bigger side here, I'm going to mirror this and put it this way. And then rotate it up. See, this side's bigger over here, so I thought it would be better over here. Now I kind of wish we I would have left these a little more no, I think these will be okay, actually. Okay, so let's leave that one there. Let's duplicate and spin. We're going to need, like, oh yeah, see? This is fine. Let's leave that one there. Actually, let's do... It looks like they kind of have two fingers up near the top here. So let's do one there, and then, yeah, and we'll do another one right on this top edge, probably, maybe. Let's see, let's stretch it out so it's a little different than the rest. And, whoa, 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 okay. Hey, 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 yeah, we are good at this. Hey, maybe we won't have to trim much off of here. We just can't have a gap there. Okay. Um, now let's take this one. Oops. So one, two, three, four. So they probably have like five, five fingers. One, two, three. Um, it's going to have however many fingers we want. Oh, no, I just duplicated that. How hard is it to select that? Not very hard. Okay. I think we're doing pretty good because, I mean, we're going to be able to um, see if we shrink this, it has more curve to it. So we can do that. Okay, we got to really start getting, because we don't have, it can't have a million fingers. So... Okay, I think that's okay. Or should we spin it a little more? Okay, maybe we'll spin it a little more like that. And what if we do one more? Hey! Okay. See, but I hit the duplicate button, um, and it copied. It copied the changes we made and like did them again, so it made it even more shrunken and. More at an angle. Wow, I'm bad at explaining stuff. Anyway, let's just plop this one in. And let's see if it's... I feel like this one should be pretty narrow. Whoopsies. What, what did I just do there? Well, I thought I wanted it narrower. There we go, and do we have to make it a little longer? Come on now. Okay. 
Okay, what do we think about that? Okay, and then they... It looks like they... You know what? They kind of have like... They have a little bit of webbing even right here. Okay, we only have to do a half of this. Because they have a foot that comes out right here. So let's go ahead and then uh, we'll make some cuts in here. Um, this is going to have to go way out. Okay. Um, this. Is this going to be okay? Let's try a little harder. Let's go there. And whoopsies, whoopsies, whoopsies. Um, let's make this a little skinnier. Um, 1.8, can I do that? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay, so should we... I feel like I should make... Well, maybe we can cut some of the wing shape out. Otherwise, should I make his leg sticking out here? How are we going to do that? Just with another... Hey, maybe we can make his... Oops. Maybe we can make his two back legs with just another sphere like this, you know? Um, no, not steer, uh, donut? What do they call this? A torus? That's not a good word. They should call it a donut. Air, wait, I mean, like, why can't we just, we'll just do his back legs like this. That's so much easier. Sure. That's fine. And we'll cut this off. Okay, so it looks like... We'll make it a little wider. There we go. Okay. Um, okay, let's start doing some cutout stuff. I feel like this one needed to get, um, let's just stretch this down a little. Okay. Does this look like a bat? Ha ha ha. Yeah, it does. Not really. Okay. Uh, just in case, does this one need to be longer? I do, 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 do. Okay. All right, let's do some cutouts now. Maybe everything will make a little more sense. What I'm doing, I guess. So let's grab a cylinder, make it smooth, and let's start doing some cutouts. Oops. Oh, yeah, we got to crank this up. That's how you make it smooth. So what does this do? What's the difference? What the? Wow, I'm 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 pro, pro level. Okay, if you hold shift, it will uniformly make objects bigger. So I was thinking, we literally need a cut. There needs to be a cut there, just in the the fabric we'll call or the wing skin so let's actually leave one um i don't even think it'll be noticeable we probably don't even have to align it okay and let's start making some cuts here 
So I'm going to probably do some different cuts. So let's start cutting out his wings here. Let's do that. And then Yeah, I mean, this is that's not a bad shape. Let's kind of fit fit one in here. How's that? Look at huh? Yeah. Whoa! See, it keeps. I haven't clicked off the object, so it keeps. Uh, when I hit duplicate, it keeps exaggerating or making the same changes again. So, see, it made this one huge. Which can be helpful, actually. Okay, honestly, that's pretty cool, actually. We don't have to be too fussy. Let's see. Let's grab another one. This one, let's shrink back down. Maybe. Oops, I raised it up. I boop. Okay, let's just kind of see. We're just kind of cutting the, the wings out here. Okay, let's do. Uh, okay. And uh, this one, let's make really small. Like, I feel like. This needs to go even farther out, you know? There. Yeah, like that. Uh-oh, but now we got to cut the whole rest of this other stuff off. Can we just use one of these? Okay, let's... Um... Oopsies. Oh, no. Did you... What? How did I manage that so quick? Okay, let's just chop this off. And now we have to chop, at least we only have to make one wing, and then we're good. Right? This better work, or you guys are in big trouble. You're grounded. So let's just try to cut off um, the red that we don't want. Okay. Uh, how do we cut off this curvy part here? Oh, dear. I guess we could just make a couple of these. <laughs> 18 minutes. Um, I think we're doing okay. Okay. Now we just duplicate that and spin it. Is this looking like a big old mess? I hope so. Look at that. Okay, so look. Oh, we just have to we have to have something happen in here. Um for now let's just do a let's just do another like cut a rooney. You know, like should we just do this for now? We can always try to round that off or something. Oh, actually, let's do that here. Let's do that after. Right now, we're just cutting the red. Correct? So, let's hold shift and just select the stuff we want. So, I'm holding down shift and we can select... Both of these. Oops. Well, honestly. Did it literally click off of everything? How did that happen? Okay, see how it's selecting these? And let's select the red. Okay. Make sure everything's good. Are you guys ready? Uh-oh. You see what I see? That's going to be floating. Oh, my goodness. Did you see that little piece of red? Oh, that would have been annoying. One more time. 
Okay, select everything. There we go. And the red. All right, you guys ready? Group. Ha ha, yeah. Cool. Obviously, we have some... Hmm. Okay, these are all good. Honestly, I should have just selected... Let's quick go back. Oh, does it? Oh, I wish it left them selected. We should have, if we want this cut off too, honestly, we should have just selected this also. Right? Oh my gosh, come on now. Don't worry, I'll get it. It's going to go fast because we don't have to make the other wing. We only have to make one wing. Okay, let's try this now. See if I screwed it up again. Yes, I did. Forgot to select the... <laughs> I forgot to select this. Okay, I think we're good. And group. Yeah, look at that. Uh, obviously, this is just... We could make it all the same color. Because it looks a little weird. Um, black will be too hard to see, but let's make him... Oh, yeah, this is a... Oh, I thought that was a good color. Is that a little too dark? Let's stick with this, and we can see... Look at how cool that is. The part that's done, anyway. Um, okay, so let's... Let's go ahead and I guess we could have finished. I guess I could have cut this, his leg off here. Because we only need half. Um, let's see. Okay, and we're going to kind of totally mirror this dude so we can kind of just half half and half this guy too um so let's see what i could select i could select that 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 oops okay let's select the stuff we want to cut and group Uh, it looks weird, but this stuff is actually under. Wow, actually, it's kind of weird that it. Why didn't it? Oh, I forgot to select. I got to select that, too. Here, you know what? We might as well stretch this up. We wanted to cut all that off. Yeah, let's just do that. I forgot to select this wing, too, because... That's also sticking over. Okay, now let's group this stuff. There we go. We're getting there, see? See, we almost got a half a bat. We haven't done his face or nothing. We're going to have to do it really quickly. Uh, here, let's make a little... Let's just make a little foot thing. Uh, let's do this. Let's just make a little smushed. He's not going to need much detail in his little foot. It's going to be so small. Know what I'm saying? So see, this would be his little back foot. If we get to it, we could add a little detail to it. Okay, we got to make it look not super stupid. Okay, we can even make it smaller or narrower. Okay, uh, honestly, that's not bad. Oh, that's too much movement. Okay, we got to do it just kind of fast. See, that's fine. We can always add maybe some little toe lines or something. Little claws or something. 
Yeah, that's fine for now. So that's his little back foot. Okay, we have to get rid of this. And we're going to be rocking. Is this connected to that? Oh. Hmm. That's okay. We we just need to get rid of that, to be honest. Okay. Let's see. How should we get rid of that? Wow. I was like, why can't I see the, the little buttons? I mean, I guess... Oops, I made it tall. I guess we could just snip it off like this, right? Uh, yeah, we could do one like that. It's going to cut the top of that off. That's fine, because we'll probably put a head over there. And... This is way too big. we got to cut a little more right here. Right? See, we're just trying to... Is this, this going to be okay? Yeah, it's okay if we leave a few little marks on there. Okay. That'll cut that off okay, don't you think? Okay, can we just group this now? It shouldn't hurt nothing. Let's do it. Hey, this is going good, guys. Hey, look at it. Like I haven't seen it already. Um, you know, we could have made this a little more of a conjunction joint. Maybe we still could. Should we add like a little... Should we add like a, a little like knuckle, like a joint, I guess? Sounds kind of weird, but let's add... Let's add a little oval so it looks like they're all coming to, like, it'd be like his hand. I guess that is his hand. Because a bat, like I said, is a mammal, so. Let's make a little long, maybe a little smaller. Smaller but longer. I just thought maybe it'd look good to have a kind of little, some kind of little joint like that, you know. Is that too big? Let's see what it looks like. Come on. That helps a little. We just would have to fix this up. If I got rid of that, I'd have to deselect all that. Um, we won't worry about that right now because that is minor. And I could spend like five minutes fixing that. And we don't got... You guys don't want to watch me do that? Okay, look it. We're doing good. Oof. We could do this. 30 minutes? Okay, we got like 15 minutes to finish this or less. Um, let's just finish cutting this weird thing off. We're going to have to add a really easy head. Not too much detail. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll see. Okay. Are we ready? Uh-oh. We didn't do... We didn't... Uh, we didn't join that together. Group. Okay. This is the part I've been waiting for. We got to... We can duplicate it finally and make him look like a full bat. I'm pretty proud of this so far. I had no idea if this was going to work. Okay, watch this. Let's duplicate and... We should probably move quicker and mirror. Do Look at this, eh? <laughs> oh my god, we did it. 
Wow, I feel like his body could be a little wider, but that's fine. We can make a new, we can bring a new little body in. Let's see if these are touching. They are now. Okay. I mean, bats do have super long wings. I feel like this could be a little fatter body, so maybe we'll do that. Um, sure. Let's just cruise. Oh, this is awesome, guys. This is awesome, right? It better be. There, is this his head? Should I leave his head like that? JK. So yeah, maybe we can give him a little little bit a little bit more belly. See, we don't even have to Yeah, there we go. That's it looks even better. Because he's got the little little whatever lower section and kind of little belly. Oh yeah, that's way better. Ah, easy. Okay, let's do let's do a head and some pointy ears. Some bats have really big ears. Have you noticed that? I think is it the fruit bats? Fruit bats look like a uh, they got like a fox face. Have you ever seen that? They actually call them flying foxes. What if we give them a blue head? Um, okay, I have no idea what we're doing here. What? Let's just, we're just going to have to, you know, I don't know. <laughs> that looks so like, okay, don't worry. We're not leaving it like that. Um, so what if we, okay, wait, for one thing, that's too big. Jeez. Small movements, much. Okay, let's just do something. Okay, how about, um, how about a cone? Let's bring a cone in. Conan. O'Brien. If they have a little um, fox face, why don't we give them a little... Can we give them a little cone sticking out? We don't want it to look like a, a weird nose. Maybe we should make it wide, but short, so it's not pointy. Whatever, let me just try it. Can't tell until we try it, right? Okay, 33 minutes. Ah, yeah, we're doing fine. I mean, honestly, that's not that bad. Oh, it's sticking out the sides a little. Let's put a let's put his big old ears on him. Um I'm the fast ear master. Watch this. Group, I mean, uh, duplicate. Slide one out. Make it into a hole. And look at it quick. And go, yeah, 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 yeah. And then combine it. And wait. There we go. Ear. They have really thin ears, but is that going to be too thin? Let's make it a little thicker by backing that out a little and stretching this up. There we go. We don't want it to print super thin or it won't be good. Won't be nice. Look, I'm, oh no, did I just, I just, uh oh, I just merged it with that somehow. Oh, please help us. Somehow I selected the whole bat. See? What is happening? This is selected. Look, I'm just going like this, and it selected part of the bat. I'm leaving that in. Because I want to. Okay, let's flip this down and put it at an angle. And let's just see what it looks like. Maybe stretch it a little, smash it. Did 
36 minutes, we're doing all right. Oh my goodness, go faster. Hee <laughs> yeah, this is already fine. Looking good. Uh, hey, actually, it'll print good. I was just going to say, that's kind of a weird angle, but that's actually good. It'll print with no supports. And you know me. Okay, so let's, let's leave it kind of tall. Do we even want it taller? I want to make sure it's connected. Okay, there we go. Duplicate, mirror, and slide it over. Boop, 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 boop. Uh-oh, are these too big? They're going to cross weird. I want them big. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's see. That looks great. I mean, obviously his face needs needs a little help. Uh, can we add a little I feel like we could even add like a weird little nose on the Oh gosh. Please don't all of a sudden start taking a ton of time. Let's see if we can make a super fast little a super fast little nose. Don't worry guys. Please don't worry. How does that look? <sighs> Look at his nose. Do you like his nose? There, we're leaving it like that. Okay. See? It didn't take me more than a minute. Don't yell at me, everybody. Okay, great. See? I told you. Ah, look at how off-centered this is. We don't even have to use the align tool. We are organic artists. That's fine. Dude. Ah, uh, yeah. Should I high-five myself? That was pathetic. I just noticed that was sticking out a little bit there. See? Oh, come on. Oh, man. We got to make his ears a little skinnier. I didn't want to. There we go. Hey, that's good. I think they just have weird little beady eyes. Uh, we can give them little... Yeah, like a real bat would have very beady little eyes. I like bats. I think they're cool. I pick them up. If you pick them up gentle by the wings and keep their wings spread out, they, their head can't reach you, so they can't bite you. Wow, we're almost done, I think. 39 minutes? I think that's pretty good for an animal model in Tinkercad. If you guys have ever done animal models in Tinkercad, you'll know they are not simple. Um, where should we put his eyes? Actually, that looks awesome right there. Okay, and duplicate. Slide it over. Mirror it. And eyeball it. See? Ha! Eyeball it! Ha! See, we don't even have to, uh... Um, let's see. Do we need to make a little cut for his mouth? I mean, uh, how easy can we do it? How quick? How quick can we do it, guys? Very quick. Not if I fumble. No fumbling. La 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 li li. Ah, little bow. Should we just make a little cut for his mouth? 
nothing wrong with that. All right, should we combine his whole face together? Or the whole bat? The whole bat's getting combined. Let's see what it looks like. Hey, we made, we did it, guys. Should we add a, we'll add a teeny bit of detail to the, I don't even care about this little part here. Ah, look at how not centered this was. That's great. Hey, hey, he looks like he's smiling almost. Talk about a flying fox. It does look like a, we got to cut his back off too. We got to have him sit flat. Um, let's quick do, we can do a couple little toe lines on here super fast. This will be simple. So let's just do like a, let's do two by two and flip it. Not that way. What is happening? What? Yeah, flip it this way. Okay, a couple little toe lines. Nothing fancy. Let's just add a couple little, uh, like just a couple little streaks on his feet so it doesn't look so stupid. Okay, so watch this. We'll just go like this. Duplicate, slide it over, and do it again. Drop that one down. That's fine. Let's just do that. So there's a little texture on them, you know. And we will duplicate that. There. Okay, that'll give them some toes, and we got to cut this back off, and we're done, guys. This is awesome. Holy cow, these wings are wide. I'll have to shrink them down to fit on my printer. At least I got the big printer. Okay, we're going to group them. Yay, this is great. If you guys do this... Um, you could take extra time and try to add a little bit of fur texture somehow to his body. That would look really cool. It would take a while, but we could do that. This guy's great. He's going to have super flat. Oh, some of this is sticking below. Oh, geez. I should have known better. Okay. Hold on. We just have to go like this. I should have known that some of that other stuff sticking below too. Okay, I'm just going to wait for this to let me combine it. There we go. Select everything. Okay. Yep. See now that's that's going to snip everything off and make his toes. So combine. Yeah, here, let's spin him and shrink him down so he at least fits on this printer bed. <laughs> we did it. Wow, he's got quite a wingspan. That's probably true, though, for like some bats have a, a huge wingspan. Ah, he's so funny looking. We did it, guys. Okay, I just want to look at him. I was so busy making him, I didn't get to look at him. Oh, he's wonderful. Oh, I love him. Okay, I'm going to print him out and let's see how he looks. And... Yay, the bat is done. Dude, this thing is awesome. Okay, and you know what? I already took it off of here and I've already been playing with it because the first thing I noticed when I picked it up is it's basically like a big glider wing. Look, we can see through it. Like, it's literally like an airplane wing. It's got supports. It's got the, um, it's got the, the thicker part at the front of the wing. And it's rigid, like, see? So I was actually already throwing this thing around and it almost flies. It almost glides. 
So what I was thinking is, for tomorrow's video, we might add some more components to this and a back fin and stabilizer, and we might be able to make this actually fly like a glider. Wouldn't that be cool? But anyway, just as a bat model, this thing is awesome. It's really flat, of course, so you could um, put it in a, a window, like, you know, you could tape it to the glass or something. Or I was thinking it's so thin, you could just, even while it was still warm, you could have curved these. See, look at how easy they curve. You could, you could pick this up when it was still warm and curve it how you wanted. You could curve the whole wings if you wanted and then hold it there till it cools and then it'll stay curved. So I think these are really cool. And it actually, it prints really fast. This was point one layer height, like the best detail. And it was like two hours. At point two, it was only gonna take like an hour to print. I guess just cause it's so dang thin. So this is fantastic. And I'm gonna try to make this thing actually fly. So for sure, stick around for tomorrow's video. <laughs> so like and subscribe. And we're going to build all kinds of crazy stuff. We'll see you guys tomorrow when this thing is gliding in the air.